Um, Robin Kirby, as I expected. Uh, yeah, this match was a little bit better because you have more more things you can use to hit Kirby on the ground. Like, you can't crouch under as many things. Like, the Dark Fire is going to hit, I would say. You might be able to crouch under the projectiles if he chooses to do so. But, um, if there's anything that can mitigate the crouching thing for Kirby will be good for uh, Grandmaster, I would say. Yeah, definitely. And here we go. And oh, 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 yeah. oh, 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 hold up. Wait, what the heck? <laughs> All right. So I, in my head, I was like, okay, well, he's not going to get hit by a second down there, right? But then he got hit by it. And I was like, oh, wait, <laughs> he's, he's out of here. <laughs> oh, my I, Lord. I, okay. So in that situation, it's actually really scary to press a button most of the time because you don't want to air dodge early and then they spike you anyway. So you just try to see, are they really going to do it? And then Jazz like, yeah, of course I'm going to do it. <laughs> he even did the unnecessary third one too. Like he wasn't even coming back. Yeah, that was nuts. Oh, but nice oh, wow, setup there. Yeah. Good, good ledge yep. trapping with, with Grandmaster. Just not letting him get back on ledge at all. Yeah. Very, very good. Yeah, Kirby's, uh, if he doesn't go from really low, he doesn't uh, snap the ledge with his up B usually. So if he has like a lazy upbeat, that's gonna get caught by arc fire every time. You gotta be very careful about that. And uh, wow, what a way to bring it back after getting pretty much decimated <laughs> that entire first stock. Yeah, okay. definitely, because like that was like, that was a good first stock. So, but now, oh, oh wow, what is that again, dude? Oh no! Oh my God, he is all over this low recovery, man. He's like, dude, JJ, you hear us? What the heck? I just like that he immediately went for the down air as soon as he went low. Like, he didn't give him a moment's uh, hesitation. And the double down air was perfect, too, as well, just to guarantee the kill. Dang. Oh, is he? Oh, okay. The... That was really good, dude. He tried yeah. to shield grab the forward air, and since it whipped, he just immediately got forward smash. Remember, Kirby has, like, no landing legs, so... You yeah. can't really do, you can't really do much out of shield like you know well grabbing wise against Kirby if he's going for an aerial aerial on your shield you're just better off just doing maybe an out of shield option or just rolling away just get away from Kirby. Yeah, it, I feel like a lot of times in this game people try to punish moves that are really safe and then they end up getting punished themselves, especially with, like you saw with shield grab. It, sometimes you just gotta recognize like okay it's not really my turn yet <laughs> I, yeah. I have to wait until I have an actual opening. But still, that was that was a sick first game from Jeja, man. Like the downers were so clean, and uh, man, that's what it takes to perform at this level with, with Kirby. I would say like, you gotta use mm -hmm. everything the character has, it, even if it kills your opponent at zero as soon as the match yep. starts. So uh, uh, yeah, we got a right, counter pick here. Uh, the pick female Robin now instead of male yeah. Robin. So hopefully yeah. this goes a little bit better. <laughs> yeah, hopefully. I, I know a lot of people prefer this version of Robin, so so maybe this is a power up in, <laughs> of sense uh, yeah. for no, no, Master. It's, it's that mindset. It's that mindset. <laughs> I love how J Dog just going for that. Uh, what's it called? The final cutter as like a zoning kind of tool, which is very yeah, interesting to do, and it's working. Yeah, it's, I mean it's the only one that Kirby has. So uh, if he's fighting against another character with a projectile, at least try at least once to see how they react to it. It's not a good projectile move at all by any means but it's just good to check robin for charging at certain distances yeah like right there, that was that. good great parry though yeah he, he canceled the charge at the shield immediately especially with the new update to parrying how uh you can act out of it way faster now so like definitely parrying projectiles is so much better now scary stuff he still has the thoron on deck as well that's why he's crouching i think <laughs> he doesn't want to get hit by it and people complain about Pikachu pancaking. Kirby can just hold down and pancake. <laughs> Ooh, man, there it is, man. Yeah, Kirby's crouch, like, he's, he's got to abuse it um, a lot more than most characters do. But, uh, oh, going for the uh, forward, forward smash yet again. Not really looking like he's at the proper percent for that to work consistently. Oh, he was oh. not having that that time. <laughs> yeah, I think Grandmaster is like, okay, man, if I go low in a bad spot again, this guy is... No hesitation. He's gonna spike me to the death. So I need to make some my recovery as much as yeah. possible. Yeah. These games look like it's going a little bit. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Time he just air dodged off stage and he had nowhere to go but up. 
and, and that was just that one was just an interception by JJ. Like, as soon as UB came out, he was already there with the down air. So, I was about to was say it's going a little spike. bit better for Grandmaster, but I, but now JJ brought it back a little bit, so that's good. Yeah. <laughs> You gotta wonder, man, how many times can you get spiked in one set and, like, be okay with it? <laughs> you know? <laughs> like, if I, yep. get, if I get spiked once, I'm already shook. Like, if I get spiked four, time, four yeah, times, four times, like, yeah. You don't, you know, whenever you get hit by a spike, they don't just hit your character. They hit you in your head, like, yeah. in the brain. Yeah. That's like, it, it sucks to get spiked. It really hurts your mindset. Luckily, though, Je uh, Grandmaster has a huge lead. And so far, Jeja hasn't really found a way around the uh, arc fire at ledge, which, you know, surprise, not, no surprise, it's one of Robin's best ledge traps. But, uh, yeah, Grand uh, Grandmaster has really been finding that right spot on the stage to catch that uh, arc fire Thoron. It's kind of yeah, why he's playing so patiently there. Yeah. But nice. Sometimes you don't even need the, uh, the arc fire to get the kill. You have really strong aerials as well. Especially, you know, against a jumping Kirby. Ooh. Ooh, the nose raw too? Yeah, and he he was behind him that time too, so he got the extra damage. Oh, he was going for it again. <laughs> Dude, he's never going to stop going for down there, and, and I respect it because oh of God. reasons like that, but he didn't get the second one that time. Very good recovery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why he's been going for that double down there so much, because uh, sometimes you actually have to get it, or else it can come back, but that forward air, forward smash again, dude. Good job, man. He has these. He has these kill confirms. Ooh, great pivot grab out of the up tilt. Yeah, really good stuff. And he's just racking up all this percent. Yep. Brought it all the way back with one really good string. Seeing good Grandmaster trying to fight back. Dodge. Yeah, Grandmaster trying to fight back in the air because he can, you know, rack up some percent, bring this back. But uh, yeah, Jeja still, and he got hit one or a few times, but he's not getting juggled that much. Okay. Opportunity to charge, nice. That's good for Sent. Not able to get a follow up, but Curry's really light, so anything he can get right now is good for him. Doesn't want to oh. go low here. Oh, oh, no, oh, no two frames. Two almost, frame. almost killing off the top. Oh, this is very close. Anyone can die at this point now. Oh, barely do dodges the dash attack, but misses the terrorist grab. But there's the anti air Thoron, not Thoron, sorry, Levin Sword. Very, very strong move. Good call out there for Grandmaster. Yep. Oh, man, that was so close, though. So close. Yeah, I think the way. female Robin counter pick was really good here. Yeah, yeah, for very, sure. Very uh, so far, 100% win rate on the female Robin, so I mm -hmm. think he should switch, uh, stay with female Robin right now. But, yeah. So, I think oh, that was PS2 they were on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Couldn't remember just now. <laughs> So it looks like I don't think they're gonna be switching stages. It looks like they're just gonna chill with PS2. Or I lied, maybe. But yeah, that was really that was really good uh, with Grandmaster there. Yeah, he got spiked like five times, and he's like, I'm, I can still win. <laughs> yeah. okay. no, 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 no more down airs. No more. Just stop it. <laughs> but it looks like we are gonna see a stage switch here. Because I saw both characters uh, go off. Oh, going back to the male Robin. Up. Uh oh. He's like, well, I don't need female Robin, man. That's what he's <laughs> trying to say right now. To be honest, I actually like both the Robin oh, yeah, me too. designs. They're both so good. <laughs> Kalos. Oh, Kalos. I always, uh, I always, you know, wonder when a um, player counter picks Kalos against another. Uh, kind of zoning character because the stage is so big it yeah. makes me wonder is it something they have like a read on the player is it their own comfortability on the stage yep we'll see and though it, and it could be it could be both in my opinion I, and also with uh with kirby on kalos you know those down airs off stage i think it's way easier to do especially with that wall right there you, uh, you, don't, have, you don't have to worry about going under the stage you just go straight down that is very true Okay, that might be something that plays a part, but oh man, swinging a little bit unsafely. Grandmaster finds the opening, sneaks in the back air. But again, with that super strong Levin Sword, but it's going for some setups here. Ooh. And I love the down smash after the down air. That was such a good, oh my God, that was such a good combo. I feel in that situation too, you're already you trying to SDI for getting hit by the down air, that you can DI that down smash really bad. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, Jeja is very scary. He's every time I see him hit someone off stage, I'm just thinking they might just die. <laughs> Especially in this matchup so far. 
He's gotten so many downers. Yeah, if I see a downer off stage, I'm like, all right, next stock. Let's go. <laughs> Especially two of them. Okay. Get, get so. catching the and sword. Genshaw is actually very smart about dealing with items. We saw it earlier with the Holy Water as well, and you can see it now with the Levin Sword too. That was a good air dodge. That was almost get, you almost got hit by that down air. Uh oh. Oh, get sniped very a little good bit. Arc but, fire. Yeah, but he didn't get stuck in the arc fire long enough for yeah. him to die for that. Oh, oh man, I thought the forest smash was coming. I don't think he has a sword. No, he has. Is that, he's he's right. I don't know. I don't know what book he just ran out of right now. Uh, he, he ran out of Thunder Book. Okay. Oh, oh that's go. a terrible trade for Jeja, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you never want to trade with Levin Sword. Just it does so much damage and knockback. Oh wow, I think he mixed up his DI there because like <laughs> I didn't expect that to kill actually. But even then, if he doesn't get the down air, he can also just go for the stone off stage too. That's actually so good. Yeah, because I, th I think I think Kirby's uh, down B sends it like up up out or something like that. And I think he was DIing in or something. It was it's it's a very weird DI. Yeah, honestly. it's actually you rarely get hit by that move in general, so a lot of people just aren't really prepared to <laughs> DI it in most situations. Yeah. Especially off stage. So that was just really good for Jeja. Oh, trying Ooh, to go with some hard fire there. setup. Good. Yeah, going something nasty. Especially if you got that platform extension as well. Okay, that trades in his favor. Gets hit yeah. by the downer, but he can come back. Oh man. No shield poke with the arc fire here either. Nice. Let's try to keep Kirby out as much as he can with these aerials. He doesn't have a sword for a little bit right now, so JJ can pressure just a little bit more. Yeah, but oh, without there it is. Sword, <laughs> but yep. There it is. Came back. Eleven swords back. Yeah, it comes back much faster than before, so. Yeah, it looks that's like really Grandma's good for trying to players. fish out for that arc fire into Eleven Sword <laughs> at this point. Yeah, he's got the back throw, though. A little bit of time to charge. Ooh. And the Eleven Sword up there. Let's go. So strong. Yep. That's kind of the rough part about Kirby not having the best like aerial speed. You know, mm -hmm. he can mix up the timing on his jump, but he doesn't go like left or right very far, very fast. So it can be difficult to get around like those large swinging hitboxes, like the up air there. Yeah, I definitely agree. Love it sword just it does so much damage and knockback and just it lasts for it lasts forever too. Yeah. Like the hitboxes just last forever. It's so weird. But good job to JJ and Grandmaster. Good games from both of these players. Grandmaster gonna be moving on. Well JJ will I think be this going... is best of five, actually. Best oh, is it my bad? Baby. Best of five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm dumb. I'm, dumb. I'm sorry. No, nah, it's it's <laughs> fine. It's fine. So I lied. Hey. Yeah, yeah, it's still going here. I, good game, I good game I feel, so far. I didn't finish my sentence. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this feels like a game five type of set, mm -hmm. if if I'm being honest. Yeah. They're both adapting to each other really well. They're both playing really well. But I wonder what we're going to see here regarding stage. JJ just lost again, so I don't know if he wants to run it back on the same stage. Because it looked like it was doing okay there until the yeah. end. Ready? Yeah. So it looks like we're going to be going... Back to Cal. Wait, did they switch? I didn't see. I don't think they. I don't think they switched. Yeah, but yeah. I think it's run back. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I wish they just showed um, the stage, man. Right. <laughs> I, wish... I, <laughs> well, agree. I, the stage. I agree. Future patch, please. Yep. Three. Okay. Okay. okay running back. back, to back. Go, game number four. JJ versus Grandmaster. So Grandmaster needs one more win. They'll be moving on in the in the top eight. Mm -hmm. No stranger for a uh, grandmaster to go really far in these top eight in the same runs. And, oh my, oh my god, god, dude! So the I talked about from the Levin sword, yeah, bro. I talked about the last game how Kirby can't really mix up his jump, you know, uh, distance. Like once he gets caught <laughs> by like these large hitboxes of Robin, it can just be a nightmare trying to land. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Grandmaster just capitalized every time, especially when he was running low on jumps. It's even harder to mix up where you're trying to go with Kirby. Yeah. Good job catching that final cutter right there with the forward air. Yeah, like, right now in this game especially, uh, Grandmaster is just calling out so many jumps. And the more aerials Robin gets, the better. Just look at how much damage that Lemon Sword does. Dude. Yeah, most definitely. Grandmaster is just like, all right, I'm done with this puffball. Let me move on and get him out of here. Yeah. Oh, dang. 
Oh, nice swing as well. Catching Jeja trying to go super aggressive off stage. He's just trying to make something happen at this point, and I oh. like that tech chase. Definitely wasn't a guaranteed up smash whatsoever, but he just knew that he put him in a scary spot. So he mm -hmm. punched that spot out really well. Oh, that was really, there. really good. Arcfire <laughs> and up smash. Yeah, that setup is dirty, man. When you get caught by that Arcfire high percent, again, Ro Robin can just pick from a plethora of options to kill you with. I, of course, you love the up smash there because it just will kill Kirby so early, but yeah, rough, rough spot for Jeja right now. Ooh. Yep. Most Radu, really good stuff. Just gain that extra heal he needs. Mm, it's a very hard move to hit, but once you get it, it's very, very rewarding. Pressure at the ledge a little bit. There. Yeah. Grandmaster's just gonna jump out of there, get back to center stage. Oh, I expected the roll in there. <laughs> Grandma's having a really, really good lead here. A full stock advantage at this point. So, and he also, you know, even if Grandmaster does, like, lose this game, he still has that one more game. So he's he's sitting very, very, very comfortable right now. While JJ, like, you know, has to take this game and then another game. Also, yeah. he's down a stop. So uh, it's kind of scary for JJ. Yeah, and that last hit of Fuerter not connecting is just, uh, so many things are just not working out for JJ right here. Yep, the patience, I like it, but... That's just enough to kill another four air one four smash. All right. This All definitely right. helped. This definitely helps his mindset a little bit. He's like, okay, one more stock. Let me just, you know, let me cool down. I'm at 100. percent I just gotta not get hit. That's yes. It. And we saw him bring this same situation back against the Rick, uh, Richter player Dark Falcon earlier. Mm -hmm. Sometimes all it takes is one edge guard. So I'm not gonna uh, count out Jeja by any means. That crouch Ooh. under with the down tilt. Wait a minute. Okay, he's at the ledge here. Oh. Can you pressure him more? Oh, okay. Okay, he's, he's safe a little bit for now. But that was very scary. <laughs> it was. Okay. That crouch under oh. the arc of uh, the arc thunder was really, oh. really good. Oh the book! The you book. gotta be careful. The book. Wait, wait, wait a minute. He catch him jabbing here. Alright, Jeja staying alive. He has opportunity. A little bit early with the down air though. Oh that's so unsafe, but no punish. And oh. there it is. No no oh, I'm we're, living, we're, I'm living. A liar. we're living just barely. Oh, watch the platform, oh, though. So, oh. okay, that was really cool. The reason why that was cool is because the Arc Thunder lowered the shield just enough to get a shield poke from yeah. the forward air. That was brilliant. Yes. That was very well done by Grandmaster there. Yeah. It's just 